I have a tripod. Put all your stuff away. <laughs> Put it away. Did you see me? I was like... I'm Allie. And I'm Hana. And, and we're, we're the Stone, Stone Travelers. Travelers. <laughs> and today we have... June of, favorites video. Yeah, it's kind of like a what we've been loving recently. Yeah. So yeah. We have some makeup products. Oop. It's and I have a couple items from ColourPop. And I have a lippy stick in Brink. And then I have two Super Shock eyeshadows in Cornelius and Kathleen Lights. And these are from I her collection, Where the Light Is, and ColourPop is really outstanding. They're only $5, and I've been really loving these every day. Yeah, I want to get some. But yeah. I <laughs> um, and then I have this color tattoo in Badge of the Bronze, and it's kind of a YouTube cult favorite. And I've just kind of, I've been looking for it, and I finally found it at Target, and I was just like, it's really nice and it's just a creamy type of base eyeshadow. And the last makeup fave I have is this Forever 21 nail polish that I got a really long time ago. And it's in the color Orchid. And this color just suits my skin tone so well. It makes me look really tan and that's for the summertime. <laughs> I was about to say like, oh, it matches your nails. Obviously, <laughs> it matches your nails. <laughs> yeah. Um, well I, well first I have this concealer by Naked Forever, it's the full cover creme de camouflage extreme, I, I don't speak French, um, and I have it in number 7, and I really like it because it's waterproof so it's good for summer, like if you want to go to the pool and, I don't know, like conceal your blemishes and stuff, and it's really, um, full coverage, it covers everything, you know. Mm. It's just, it's really great, and it's good for um, highlighting your under eye circles, bags, things, you know. <laughs> I'm just laughing because my dog just came in. His name is Louie, and he's a Boston Terrier. I think he's like 10 months old now. I also have another dog, but she doesn't oh. like <laughs> But yeah, I'll put him down now. <laughs> and then I have... This mini Tarte Energy Cheek Stain from Tarte. Yeah, and um, it's really cool because I'm actually running out of it, but it comes out, it's clear, but then it changes to your pH, and it, like, I don't know, it's kind of like a Science customized... Is. Yeah, <laughs> it's like a customized um, shade. And then finally, I have my NARS Eyeshadow Duo in... Kuala Lumpur and it's this really nice pink and plum shade and it's really pretty and you can wear them alone or together and they're just really nice to like brighten the eyes everything yeah <laughs> hence our name stone travelers we just yeah. really love stone crystals and we're into all that mm -hmm. chakra stuff and just meditating and getting those like good vibes for yourself and I got this necklace, and I got it from a flea market. Did she tell um, me what, what stone it is? I don't really know what it is, but it kind of looks like... It looks what like is a it? Like, aura quartz. Yeah. It's on a leather strap. And then I have these two crystals that she gave me, because she recently went on a road trip. Yeah, I, I have a vlog coming up. Yeah. Actually, it'll probably be uploaded before this. But yeah, we don't know yet. <laughs> but um, she got me this pyrite, and it kind of, it's nicknamed Fool's Gold, I think. Mm -hmm. And then this quartz, because I really like quartz. I haven't found my crystal yet, but I really like this. Okay. And then this is, a, this is a worry stone from Urban Outfitters, and you just kind of like rub it like this. <laughs> and it just, I... It takes all your worries away. Yes, because I am a very stressful person, so this really keeps it handy in my pocket when I just, like, pull it out. She's and then like... just... <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that's, I use that for that. Yeah. And then when I was on my trip to Yosemite, I, I actually bought a lot of other stones, and we're, we're actually going to make a crystal video, and mm -hmm. 
it'll be all our crystals and stuff but um my favorite one that I got is this Labradorite and it's just really pretty like you can see in certain lighting it has like a, a sheen and it also it's really cool because it has this like crack in the middle with a bunch of little stones and I was really surprised when I found it because I got the stones in those little like boxes that you see at like Gift um, shops. Gift shops are like, yeah, I got mine at a gift shop, but um, they also have it at, oh yeah, SeaWorld. And I don't know, it's just like a bunch of stones and you put them in a bag and whatever, it's like one price. But I was so surprised to find that because I thought they would only have like quartz and stuff. Yeah, but they yeah. had a good selection there. Yeah, I can tell. Um, next we have our fashion favorites. We both have grid shorts. <laughs> oh, I know. But I mean, mine's not really grid. I have these, um, Checker. Oh, gingham. 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 I don't know. Gingham. 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 I don't know. Um, shorts from American Apparel. Here we go with the American Apparel. Oh yeah. <laughs> Back but, at it. Um, they're just these. I think they're the riding shorts, and I had to zip it up. <laughs> but they're just nice for summer. They're really breezy, but they're kind of like form fit, form fitting, and um, yeah, they're a nice linen cotton material, and. They're high waisted too, but yeah. Um, and then I have these grid shorts that are really minimalistic with drawstrings, and it is from Brandy Melville. And it's honestly kind of like pajama shorts, but they're so comfortable. They're very cute on. Oh, thanks. <laughs> and it's like it kind of just gives you that like really casual look that's still kind of put together. And oh, I just realized these were in our. Lookbook. Mine wasn't. Wait, mine was. These yeah, were in our wasn't. beach lookbook. So uh, oh, yeah. if you want to go check it out, we'll put it right here. <laughs> <laughs> and then I have these swimsuits from H&M. And it's not buckled. But they're basically <laughs> triangle dupes, to be honest. And I kind of prefer these because it has this little buckle. And it's so supportive. But it's still like, you know... Like, it's it's kind of tiny, but <laughs> it's it's still supporting them, you know? They're you know what I'm they're saying? Not they're, they're okay. But it's the mesh, and it's this kind of cyan blue, which used to be my favorite color. And I don't know if it is, but it What's used to be. What's your favorite color now? I've been liking orange. That's a favorite. A oh, yeah? Favorite color, <laughs> orange. And then it came with these matching bottoms, and it has these cutouts where your hips go. And... Uh, they're just bottoms that match the top. And these look your hair cut in your head now. <laughs> but they look really cute together. And they're um, from H&M. Oh, I could show my incense. Yeah. Yeah. Um, lately, I've been really, really, really into incense. And I've been lighting them, like, every day. And this one's really nice. My mom doesn't like it for some reason. She thinks... I don't know. Um... But she doesn't like this one, but I love it. It's Elong Elong Tree to Nature. Oh, True to Nature. Just kidding. Um, incense sticks. And I think she got these at Sprouts, maybe. And then I also um, got these on my trip to San Francisco. And they're just these assorted ones. It, they have um, sandalwood and green tea. Ocean breeze. Orchid. Um, orchid. Jasmine. Oh, my God. The jasmine one is my favorite. I, anything like jasmine or like picake or plumeria scented like She's the a floral person. I'm a floral person. Um, like the Hawaiian flowers. Those, oh my gosh, they're my favorite. I wish you could smell it. But <laughs> it smells so good. Mm -hmm. And I'm not really like a floral person, but I really like it. Yeah. Um, actually, unfortunately, I, hold on. <laughs> this holder for my incense sticks and I didn't know that you're not supposed to use the cone ones on here so I burned it but I would put this in my favorites too but I have to get another one I think this one was actually from or Arizona <laughs> I, I when I went to Arizona things. in Sedona yeah but yeah whatever cool cool um so I have this book called Rookie Yearbook 3 and the reason, the main reason why I bought this was because of our fellow YouTuber, Kiana Hearts. And I've loved her for a very long time. I'm going to get really fangirlish. But, um, <laughs> <laughs> she's such an inspiration and she's such a positive person. 
and she inspired me to get this book by Tavi Jevonson, I think. Mm -hmm. um, and basically, it's just kind of like it it's showcases like a, a lot of yeah. It's kind of giving <clears throat> that scrapbook type of look, and it kind of it tells a lot of stories, music, DIYs. Yeah, and like kind of like advice for people our age and it comes with really cool stickers but as you can see <laughs> you used I used most <laughs> um but yeah I really like this book it's really nice to just put on a table and you can just read it when you're bored and it's it's a really nice book next I have our fellow my, Jeffrey our fellow uh, <laughs> our fellow Jeffrey from I okay so my friend Dana um shout out to Dana for showing me Jeffrey um she has uh, the same broccoli from Ikea and I was like, oh my god, I want this so bad because look how cute, look how cute he is, he's so cute. Um, and yeah, I just, I really wanted it and then I finally went to Ikea because you can't buy it online and I was like, okay, I'm gonna buy him. And then, um, um, Hana has a succulent that she got at the Melrose Flea Market. <gasps> oh, but my she had, had, had a succulent. But yeah, I guess... Mm -hmm. Her cat's destroyed. Yeah, Bill. so Rip I, Bill. Yeah, she named Bill. Oh yeah. I named Jeffrey. She named Jeffrey for me. So. Bill is struggling. Is he did you replant him? Kind of. I don't know how <laughs> to. So it's like it's like tilted and it's like the roots are kind of falling out, but it's it's gonna work. It's gonna <laughs> it's, it's gonna work out. It's gonna work out. Yeah. But yeah, Jeffrey's just a broccoli. A just a little simple, simple broccoli. broccoli. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, he's wearing like a dress or a skirt, I don't, I don't he's know. He's looking good, that's he's for looking sure. looking good. That picnic style, kind of matches. Gingham. Gingham, kind of matches my shorts, I guess. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And yeah, I really like Jeffrey. We have some music favorites. You can show oh. us first. Um, well, I bought this Bob Marley remix of The Legend album. <laughs> um, vinyl from Amoeba. And I, okay, like, originally I wanted the original Legend album, but I didn't, I was stupid, and I wasn't paying attention, and I, like, I don't know, I was in a rush, too, so I just bought this, but I actually really like this, um, it's, it has two discs, and they just look like this, you know, um, and my favorite one is side one on the first, um, vinyl, but... Yeah, there's a lot of nice songs on here, but I'm still looking forward to buying the original one because, like, how can you beat original Bob Marley, you know? True. Um, and then a song that we've both been loving is the song called Do You by Spoon. And it's, we'll insert a clip. Oh, yeah. Do, 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 do. <laughs> and it's um, just a really summery song, and I've just been listening to that to feel. I don't know. It's it's in a playlist that I made called Feel Good Central because it makes me feel good. You know. You know what I'm saying. I have really been loving Radcat on SoundCloud, and he's such a good remixer. And I just I found him because I think um, G Nash like. Um, reposted one of his remixes of uh oxytocin yeah and i just fell in love it was so good and i i don't know it's just been my obsession lately and i also have a movie favorite it is almost famous i um my cousin actually showed this movie to me and i'm so late on the band on the bandwagon but it's such a good movie like please watch it if it's about um this young writer and he's probably, I don't know how old he is, he's like 17 or something, and he goes and follows like a bunch of bands, and he follows, I think it was Stillwater, and their journey on their tour, and it's, oh, it's so good. It's one of my favorite movies, obviously, because it's in our favorites video, but, um, so yeah, that's pretty much it, and yeah. that's just what we've been enjoying. And thank you so much for watching. We'll and thank you, you later. for a hundred subscribers. Yeah, we hit a hundred subscribers. You know how happy we were. I, we were just kind of like, <laughs> I know everybody's like, oh my god, I got a hundred thousand subscribers. And, and then we're like, just like, oh my god, we have a hundred <laughs> subscribers. 
Um, but yeah, thank you so much. Yeah, thank and you. Just like, comment, subscribe, subscribe. <laughs> and we'll see you later. Bye. Bye. We put this up because we couldn't, we didn't want to stare at ourselves. <laughs>